Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss out on our latest content. Today, we're diving into a topic that's both relatable and super annoying, feeling nauseous for no apparent reason. Let's get into it. First things first, feeling nauseous can be a total bummer. You're just going about your day, minding your own business, and bam. Out of nowhere, that queasy feeling hits you like a ton of bricks. But why does this happen? Let's break it down. 1. Stress and anxiety. Believe it or not, your mind and body are super connected. Stress and anxiety can cause a whole bunch of physical symptoms, and nausea is one of them. When you're stressed, your body goes into fight or flight mode, which can mess with your digestive system and make you feel sick to your stomach. So, if you're feeling overwhelmed, that might be the culprit. 2. Dehydration. Yep, something as simple as not drinking enough water can make you feel nauseous. When you're dehydrated, your body struggles to function properly, and nausea can be one of the first signs. Make sure you're drinking enough fluids throughout the day to keep that queasy feeling at bay. 3. Diet. What you eat or don't eat can play a huge role in how you feel. Skipping meals, eating too much junk food, or having a diet that's lacking in essential nutrients can all lead to nausea. Try to stick to a balanced diet and see if that helps. 4. Motion sickness. Even if you're not on a roller coaster or a bumpy car ride, you can still experience motion sickness. Sometimes, simply moving around too quickly or watching something that moves fast can trigger that nauseous feeling. Your inner ear plays a big role in your sense of balance, and when it's thrown off, nausea can strike. 5. Medications. Certain medications can cause nausea as a side effect. If you've started a new medication recently, check the side effects listed on the label. It might be worth talking to your doctor about any symptoms you're experiencing. 6. Hormonal changes. For all the ladies out there, hormonal changes can be a major factor. Whether it's due to your menstrual cycle, pregnancy, or menopause, fluctuating hormones can definitely make you feel nauseous. 7. Illness or infection. Sometimes nausea is just your body's way of telling you something's not right. It could be a stomach bug, food poisoning, or another type of infection. If your nausea is accompanied by other symptoms like fever, headache, or vomiting, it might be time to see a doctor. 8. Inner ear issues. Your inner ear controls balance, and any issues with it can lead to dizziness and nausea. Conditions like vertigo or labyrinthitis, inflammation of the inner ear, can make you feel like the room is spinning, causing nausea. 9. Gastrointestinal problems. Conditions like GERD, gastritis, or IBS can cause chronic nausea. If you're dealing with regular stomach issues, it's a good idea to consult a gastroenterologist to get to the bottom of it. So, what can you do? If you're feeling nauseous for no apparent reason, here are a few tips that might help. Stay hydrated. Drink plenty of water and avoid caffeinated or alcoholic beverages. Eat small, frequent meals. Instead of three large meals, try eating smaller, more frequent meals throughout the day. Relax in distress. Practice relaxation techniques like deep breathing, meditation, or yoga. Ginger or peppermint. These natural remedies are known to help with nausea. Consult a doctor. If your nausea persists or is severe, it's always best to seek medical advice. And that's it for today's video, folks. I hope you found this information helpful. If you did, give this video a thumbs up, and don't forget to share it with anyone who might find it useful. Drop a comment below if you've ever experienced unexplained nausea and what helped you. See you in the next video. Stay healthy and take care. Peace out.